Welcome to my August 2020 video newsletter. We do have a lot to talk about, uh, but we'll do the stats first, and then we'll come back for some commentary. As we look at the data for the second quarter, it's, it's no surprise that we, uh, we, we are down. Uh, the COVID thing kind of hit us really hard uh, in the second quarter. Uh, we're going to see that there's some changes afoot, but we'll get to that part later. Uh, year to date, as of the uh, end of the second quarter, we're uh, 52 closings. That's down 16 percent from uh, from 26, 2019. Uh, that whole all the downness, of course, came in that in that second quarter. Um, the uh, median price, uh, median sale price, is also down about four percent from uh, where where we closed out 2019. Uh, we'll see how that uh, changes over time. It may not get better, but it probably will. As we look at uh, new listings, uh, we were down, of course, for uh, March, uh, April, and May, but up significantly for, for June, up 75% from where we were last year. I expect the numbers will, be, uh, will continue to be, be good, if not uh, higher than the previous year for, for a few more months. Uh, we'll see. We, we have a significant uh, inventory problem. As you can see from this next chart, uh, we are down 50% from where we were last year at this time. A little bit of that is, has to do with the uh, number of houses that have gone under agreement, but the fact is being down uh, dramatically uh, curtails the amount of homes, uh, the number of homes that people can see when they come out. One of the stat I don't have a chart for, not because it's mostly never been relevant before, is the number of pending uh, houses relative to the number of, uh, of active houses. The number of pendings is up dramatically. We have uh, 52 homes uh, pending. Uh, Typically, that bodes very, very well for the, for the following months because those houses will close out. We have more pendings at this time, or houses under agreement, than we actually have houses uh, on the market. Uh, that uh, bodes for a very strong uh, seller's market, and we're, we're seeing that as homes get snapped up pretty quickly as they go on the, as they go list, as they get listed. Looking forward, uh, the truth is it's all about the, uh, about the listings. Uh, new listings, of course, uh, fuel sales, and sales uh, fuel the market, and so consequently, the, uh, there's plenty of buyers here. Uh, the buyers are just looking for a, a place to go uh, uh, when, when they want to do uh, working from home or when the kids are off from school. But anyway, that, that said, uh, it's, it's about the listings. Uh, I expect that uh, we'll be able to satisfy, uh, at least in the short term, uh, most of those folks, and so I expect the year will finish out well. Uh, but on the other hand, there's certainly a lot of unknowns ahead. So stay well, and I'll talk to you uh, next month.